What's up guys, TechRacks here. So in this video, I've got a drone. I've got the new iPhone 10 S Max right here. It's attached to a string. What I'm gonna be doing today is I'm gonna be dropping that iPhone from that cooling tower uh, or nuclear power plant. This is an abandoned one. We're gonna walk down there and retrieve the phone as soon as it falls. But this thing is like 530 feet tall. And uh, this is gonna be kind of crazy, guys. I wanna drop it in there and see if it can survive. I haven't even checked out the area. I don't know what's under there. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna have the slow motion on the iPhone XS and we're gonna fly it up. I've got the drone here. Hopefully all goes well. It's a little foggy up there, but let's go ahead and see what happens. Guys, we're gonna go ahead and find where this iPhone is. I'm gonna have to climb over this fence. It has to be somewhere here. There's a huge echo when I talk in here too. But it's kind of a big area, so. Oh, I think I see it. I think I see it. Oh my goodness. What? This is it. It's, wow, the fishing line is super loose. It's still recording. Hold on, let me press pause. As you guys can see, the front is definitely cracked already. You can see there's a huge shatter on the front display. The back is not cracked. Corners are pretty good. Um, it's just super dirty. Here's the bottom. And I got the video, and the phone literally works. This is where it landed, this huge area. Look at this. That is incredible. It took actually like 10 seconds for the phone to fall. I was waiting, waiting for it across the fence, and I'm like, why don't I hear anything? And then it fell, and here it is. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. That pretty much wraps it up. Um, as always, guys, stay tuned for more videos, and peace out.